So yeah, KLX and CRF. Look at the difference. This is the 2023, right? Yeah. It's a brand new. So that one has more horsepower, better handling, better suspension. The, the motor, I guess it's uh, probably the same same style. Kawasaki usually like does very similar stuff, but they end up making better bikes, more horsepower and suspension. So really nice. The radiator's on the left, on the right. Mine is on the left. My horn is on the right. His is on the left. Blinkers. They are clear, mine are amber. It's got the aggressive motocross styling, bark busters. I'm like looking for a- These are T-Rex uh, T T-Rex hand guards, and you've already used them, they worked. Yeah, they do work. And you got the high risers, yeah. so that makes it a little bit nicer yeah, to ride. 30 millimeters, I think. I think too that the the coolant bottle, like as you're riding, I'm seeing it uh, move around. I, I love that they put it there. Yeah. And on mine, it's got a nice feature. Uh, this is kind of ingenious. Honda didn't put anything there. They put a little compartment. Oh, nice. So. That is. Yeah, that's a nice I idea. I to have that. I don't know why. Oh, but Kawasaki put the coolant there. So it's a trade-off. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's uh, we'll, we'll, uh let me look at the the dash here. Nice, nice tack, very completely digital. Let's see. Starts right up. So he's got it all hooked up. This feels very much like that DRZ. Yeah, this is very loud. <laughs> very uh, loud. Wow. Yeah. Are these stock? Yeah. So are they. Oh yeah, look how quiet that is. High beam, turn signals, the way it should be. This is nice, it actually protects your master cylinder. It feels much narrower, but it also feels lower. And suspension really feels much better. So, this bike, it kind of feels, I think I need to, kind of, Good power. Look at all the mud just flinging off. Oh, it just got hit in the mouth. Let me close this. Very quiet. I mean, like, when you have something this quiet, it feels like you are not even riding. It's deceiving. Yeah, suspension on this is a little bit nicer the rear end on mine feels like a pogo stick compared to this yeah I think I have to fix a little bit of the suspension let me hit my front brakes and see no car behind me let me just yeah it dives in as much as mine Yeah, it feels like a proper dirt bike. Doesn't have a lot of power. Mine doesn't have a lot of power either. It, it feels, might feels like it's got more power, but that's because of the exhaust. The exhaust makes it sound more powerful. That's why if you're gonna be dual sporting, an exhaust is nice. This one, there's no sheltering from the wind at all. But the dash is also very low you don't have an issue like seeing it but it um, it rides fine easy to read the speedo the speedometer is right in the middle you attack it's uh digital it reminds me of the rc51 it's got the dummy lights very kawasaki to have everything kind of he's tall so the uh <clears throat> the mirrors are adjusted for him This is 
way faster. That's, yeah, this is faster. I like how the CRF looks. I think it's better looking in my eyes. The CRF rally is better looking. I'm not comparing it to the regular one, but this thing is peppier. It's definitely peppier than mine. I can't tell the difference between this one and the CRF 300 that I rode. But the suspension is very similar to the 300. The 300 CRF 300 was a little spongier, softer than this. This feels properly tuned. The forks, <clears throat> not as good as the rear suspension. Rear suspension is like firm, planted. The forks, better than the CRFs. The shocks are better than the CRFs. So pretty amazing. And that's what Kawasaki tends to do. They will take Honda's initial design. They do that a lot with their, they copy it and then they make it better. They make it slightly better. And it's a hard, you know, you might as well just get this than the CRF because the CRF Honda, the value is a little bit higher. Kawasaki's, you can get great deals on them. Yeah. Suspension is better. What? It's w even this, um, the forks are better. They feel better. So that's what Kawasaki that's does. They're brand new. It is brand new. Yeah, that one's got fifteen, sixteen thousand. Yeah. So, man, thanks for letting me ride this thing. That is a cool bike. Suspension is better. Motor stronger smooth and it's hard to tell too with the exhaust the exhaust makes it sound like it's going faster you're yeah you, that is very loud yeah <laughs> do you uh, when i was passing you were you giving it full gas probably not full but i wasn't i wasn't like gingering it but i had more to go you know i wasn't lollygagging nice bash plate that he's got Yeah, Kawasaki always puts like good deals on their bikes. They just make them a little bit better. Then have a fuel gauge. That's crazy. Oh my. Ah, oh, I hate that. I like having a fuel gauge. That was fun. Oh, see? And Kawasaki did not flip the signals and the horn. Look at these bad boys with their fancy cars. 